Hello viewers, this is IT System Admin, a complete troubleshooting solution for you. Today in this tutorial, I am going to show you how to backup automatically files and folders in Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. Sometimes it becomes very important for you, so don't forget to watch full video. We never know when our hard drive will stop working and we lose our important data. It's a high risk of data loss during a cyber attack or natural disaster. Therefore, it is always a good idea to perform a regular backup to protect your important data against system failure and malware attack. Now, I am going to show you how to create automatic backup files and folders in Windows 10 computer. Now I am creating a folder on my desktop name my files And I am keeping some files here. So now open the folder. Again, opening file, file explorer and we go to another location. Here I am creating another folder named backup. Open the backup folder. Now, I am opening a command x copy. Now, path of the source folder. This is my source folder, my files, and click here. And I am copying the location. Now, paste here and now I need part of the destination folder this is my destination folder backup okay copy it Now paste here. Now I don't need these three options. Now I have to save it as a bad file. Click on file, click on save as. Save as type will be all files and the file extension will be bat auto backup dot bat and the file location in desktop okay now save it okay now i can this one auto backup dot bat okay now right click on this folder and click on open look the files already backed up now i will copy these two files 
and paste in my files. Now I will open this auto backup program again. Right click on auto backup and click on open. Look, already update my backup file. Now I will show you how to create casual for periodical backup in SARS type SCHE. This is SARS scheduler. Right click on SARS scheduler and click on run as administrator. Now click on task scheduler library. Now click on create task. Give a name. I'm giving my backup. Click on trigger. Click on new. Now on a schedule, click daily. Start date is today. Now click on enable and now 50 the time has been changed 5 7 okay and status is enabled now and click on okay now we will wait for critical backup we have to wait Look, the automatic backup has been completed. All files have been backed up in our backup folder. Now close both file explorer. If you want to delete your schedule, you just open task scheduler and task scheduler library, then right click on your backup schedule file and click on delete and the schedule file will be deleted now close task scheduler this is all for today hope this tutorial is helpful for you keep watching for next tutorial thank you very much